Kelly Scott was diagnosed with COVID in December. She says there was one symptom that lasted longer than the rest. I made a cup of coffee and I didn't smell it and I didn't taste it. So that was disappointing. Scott is far from alone. We've had a tremendous number of patients that have come in with loss of smell from COVID. Piedmont Hospital ENT surgeon Dr. Shathel Parikh says anosmia or loss of smell takes place when the virus causes inflammation in the nerve cells that run from your olfactory nerve in the top of your nose to your brain, basically blocking the smell message from reaching the brain. Parikh says the scary part is it could take months or even years to get your sense of smell back, and it's not a sure thing. 85% get their smell back in one year. About another 5% it takes uh, up to two years and 10 to 15% may not ever get their smell back. Um, now that's that's our studies with some of the older viruses. This, the coronavirus is new, the uh, COVID is new, so we just don't know. But there is something that could help. It's called smell therapy and here's how it works. Parikh says to think of smells like colors with four primary types, floral, fruity, aromatic, and resinous. Twice a day, you take deep inhalations of these four smells stimulating the olfactory nerve and actually regenerating the neural pathways. Parikh says you can use items in your kitchen like cloves or fresh cut lemons, but the easiest way is to use essential oils that hit those four marks and just breathe them in a couple of times a day. There's really good data out that shows that smell therapy is beneficial at improving the recovery of the smell nerves. They saw in studies uh, that you had about a 10 to 15 percent improvement over time. An improvement that could make a huge difference for people like Scott. I thought naturally it would come back, but now that it's kind of been a little while, I'm, I'm definitely like interested in trying anything at this point. Dr. Parikh says if your smell hasn't fully returned three months after COVID, you could be a good candidate for this kind of smell therapy.